Hello guys, so this video is very amazing because I'm going to discuss here which exam is tough, IIT J exam is tough or GATE exam is tough. So see here, based on some practical facts I will discuss. Uh, why do we say IIT exam is tough? So see, uh, to say uh, about toughness level, I have categorized this in three ways. Like first thing, uh, how much crowd is there in any exam? And like what is the intensity of the course? Like how uh, lengthy the courses and how well defined the courses and now other than that how many seats are there so these three criteria are there so see when you talk about uh, how many uh, number of students are taking any exam so automatically number of seats uh, will matter a lot correct so actually uh, if you think about IIT J exam so in IIT J if you are getting 4000 rank then definitely you will be getting seats somewhere in some IITs but it is not like in gate exam right in gate exam seats are very limited uh, see see one one thing if you are very new to my channel spend some three to four days on my channel i have all the content available for gate aerospace engineering i have qualified gate five six times and i have uploaded all the uh, content already like everything is there on channel go visit the channel classes are going on live classes uh, video recording courses everything is available tcg is available so join the class as soon as possible whenever you are watching this video so don't delay this so i am taking i am teaching it exam from last seven plus years and i have given so many toppers so blah blah things are there about me you can just visit the channel you will come to know about uh, different different playlists are there okay so now come to the main point uh, gate exam is tough very clear gate exam is tough now see uh, why gate exam is tough so see first you talk about number of uh, uh, seats uh, just an example, if you are in general category and you are getting, uh, actually this, this video is especially like whenever I make video, I used to be very specific about aerospace department because uh, I uh, like, that's why I have very less subscribers as well because in aerospace, my, my, my core viewers are aerospace department, aeronautical department viewers, okay. So if you talk about uh, aerospace department, uh, roughly uh, 4,500, 4,600, 4,800, 5,000, this kind of uh, total number uh, will be there in, a, in gate exam. Like if, if you are unaware then like you remember like in UPSC you can select your courses right. In UPSC, in IS exam, in IPS exam you can select your uh, courses right. Like which course you are opting uh, to take the exam in the same way. In gate exam also whatever branch you are doing in your uh, BTEC or BE does not matter. You can choose your a specific branch to take gate exam for example if you are from mechanical department you can choose aerospace department so this is like if you are from aerospace department you can uh, you can choose mechanical department to take uh, gate exam but it will be your own complications when you are uh, when you will change your uh, like uh, uh, department right so like for example if i am from aeronautical department and if i am going to write mechanical department so some few things will be similar but definitely core is entirely different okay so if you are in general category then if you are getting uh, three, 300 rank if you are in general category and you are getting 300 rank then it is like very very difficult you can say no chance to get seat in aerospace department in any iits okay so uh, like you can say seat wise uh, in mtech in masters uh, like mtech or ms like uh, opportunity is very less seat wise you have to be in double digit rank if you want to secure a, your seat in IITs if you are a general category student okay so uh, and one more thing guys actually in IITJ uh, all the toppers are arranged one by one one by one one by one like that okay like uh, topper one topper two topper three topper four like that topper four thousand topper five thousand like that but in gate exam this is not the scene in gate exam, if you are uh, taking gate exam from mechanical department and I am taking gate exam from uh, aerospace department and suppose, uh, so so you know what, you will also get first rank and I will also get first rank in different different departments. And uh, not only this, actually see, uh, suppose uh, you are getting 10th rank in mechanical department, I am getting 10th rank in aerospace department and we both want to apply for astrophysics in any IIT, for example, uh, uh, ISC. Uh, we want astrophysics in IASC. So uh, you are also getting 10th rank in mechanical department. I am also getting 10th rank, uh, rank in aerospace department. Now we both want that astrophysics in IASC Bangalore. You know, then uh, rank does not matter there. So you, you may be aware of there is something called SCORE. S-C-O-R-E. SCORE. So our admissions in master degree is based on SCORE. It is not based on our gate rank. 
so which makes this another difficulty level okay in iit if your rank is third rank okay you are the only person with third rank but in gate exam like uh, like from mechanical department from uh, civil department from electrical department from any other department students with good score like i am in uh, so, so my rank is 10th so i'll be having my own score as per uh, my topper and i mean aerospace topper and aerospace difficulty level in mechanical department uh, their topper and their difficulty level okay based on that uh, their score will be uh, decided so uh, like if if you are in mechanical department with 10th rank and, and if i am in aeronautical department with 10th rank but our score uh, will be definitely different so which score is better which score is my score is better or your score is better so that person will be having more opportunity to take astrophysics in uh, in iit in iisc bangalore okay so like this so this makes exam very tough get exam very tough okay and of course uh, if you if you are like uh, uh, like if your general rank is 250 then then you keep in mind that you are not going to get iit very fortunate if someone is leaving the seat and uh, fortunately uh, like in the last uh, spot on admission uh, you you may get the seat but you consider there is no seat but this is not the case right now now talk about next kind of psychological difficulty level in gate exam see guys when you are prepare, uh, when you are in 11th 12th class okay that time like people are not that mature so almost everyone uh, is at same level uh, like but definitely some students are preparing in uh, very heavy like they are putting themselves into so much very good preparation they are doing so much coaching coaching and in different different coaching centers and they are preparing themselves like they are making themselves very strong okay so this is the only difference uh, but on average if you see people are fighting a lot uh, iit ji but th that level that age that age is not that mature age uh, and none of you are iitian when you are preparing for iit ji exam you all are in 11 12 standard okay but when it comes to gate exam then students are doing their bachelor degree in nits students they are doing ba their bachelor degree in iits and some other reputed colleges they all are going to write gate exam uh, together so imagine if you are a person uh, who could not qualify iit or uh, uh, any kind of uh, national or state level entrance exam and you could not get very good seat very good college and uh, suppose you are pursuing your uh, uh, bachelor degree from any private college so you should not be offended uh, but like mostly uh, students are saying that most of the time they say their private college is not good they are i mean it, it, they don't sound exactly in this way they say that uh, this particular faculty or this particular subject uh, when they prepare during gate exam then they understand very well anyway i mean to say that a student is uh, if student is uh, uh, going to a private college uh, without qualifying an entrance exam and student is uh, sitting into iit then if you compare the four years then of course the student who is sitting into iit or iist or uh, some other reputed uh, engineering colleges so their level of bachelor degree and their concept clarification will be very different correct as compared to the person who is sitting into private college i am not saying 100% on average this is the scene there are many students from private college also uh, they can qualify gate exam with first rank of course it, it is possible okay so uh, most of the time uh, most of the iitians they don't even uh, appear in gate exam anyway so the, where where i'm trying to take you i'm trying to take you that uh, when you write uh, iit j exam then every student is in 11th standard 12th standard i mean sorry 12th standard they are in 12th standard or pass out but when you are preparing for a uh, gate exam then already there are uh, there is a group of crowd they are from iits and nits and from other colleges they are also writing gate exam so so already like it, it is like this kind of competition okay but still you should not lose your hope because it is a fight if you see the list like from my own institute i have given 22 rank uh, uh, that is my best rank till now from my institute 22 rank uh, in in gate exam but the student was not from iit or nit that student was from private college but it is a capacity capability of student that doesn't matter from which college you are pursuing your uh, bachelor degree it all depends how good you are okay by mistake if you are missing iit je in your 11th 12th class after that you could not uh, pursue your bachelor degree because you were immature it's not like your brain is less it's not like that many students they are immature when they are in 12th class but 
during uh, uh, four years of BTEC degree, during this uh, uh, four years of journey, they improve a lot. They improve socially, they improve academically. Many people, they go to gym and they, they, they make very good body. I mean, I mean, uh, in these four years, situation can be like this and like this. Many students, they are very good students in uh, 11th, 12th and they have a clear IIT and IIT. They are sitting into I IITs and IITs. But, but during four years of their BTEC, uh, they didn't perform well. Correct. Uh, because of a lot of reasons, they didn't perform well. And uh, of course, uh, uh, there are some situations like they are getting a 400 rank and 500 rank in grade exam. And uh, students from private colleges, they are getting very good rank. I mean, uh, my main focus is get exam is actually a tough exam because uh, competitors are there. Okay. And they are properly mature people. They are writing, they are taking get exam. And actually in IITJ exam, you have age bonding and attempt bonding, right? You have attempt bonding. But in gate exam, you don't have attempt bonding. So it means what? Like I myself, I have qualified six times. So whenever I am appearing uh, next time, I will be giving competition to someone. That is different that I am not going to pursue master degree, um, PhD degree. But uh, yes, these kind of people are there. They have qualified gate exam. But again, next year, they will uh, uh, sit in the exam and they will uh, qualify the exam. And you should not say this negative facts or why are you uh, cutting someone's uh, uh, seat? Uh, no guys that does not matter because admission is based on score admission is not based on rank okay so anyway it's not like uh, uh, if my rank is if, uh, if if i am getting 10th rank then someone else cannot get 10th rank no you can also get 10th rank okay so that is also a beauty like same person like uh, same rank two three persons can get the same rank same score okay okay so now what is next thing what makes get exam tough that is the syllabus that is the pattern of get exam it is not uh, like, see, in case of IITJ, uh, syllabus is defined very properly and study material, everything, practice, everything is defined very properly by different, different coaching centers, by schools and by self-study also. Uh, like you can have a detailed, properly defined syllabus and you know from this portion, question will appear for sure. From this question, what kind of question will come? From this question, from this portion, what kind of question will come? But in gate exam, it is not the case. In gate exam pattern, like amazing man, if you if you are uh, preparing for gate exam and uh, if you are watching this video then you should uh, you will get my logic what i'm trying to say in gate exam this is not the case pattern is not well defined okay that makes this exam again very tough exam so actually if you are preparing for gate aerospace exam like mostly whatever i'm talking my my way is inclined towards gate aerospace exam so if you are preparing get aerospace exam, very good. If you are not preparing, join my institute immediately, guys. I have everything. I have recorded videos. I have video courses. Different, total 19 different programs I am running for gate aerospace 2023. Properly designed test series with detailed solution and everything. So let's meet on WhatsApp. Thank you so much.